there. Here's a fun science yummy activity that you could do with your child for summertime. And it's making ice cream in a bag. So I'm going to go ahead and go over those directions with you, and then we're going to make it together. So right here, I have a piece of paper, and it talks about making ice cream in a bag, and it's the ingredients that you're going to need. So in a small sandwich bag, you are going to um, mix a half a cup of milk and one tablespoon of sugar and a half a teaspoon of vanilla. And you and your child can do this together. This is great because you guys can work on it together. Now, the fact that it goes into a sandwich bag, you're probably going to have to do that part because, you know, if they let go of it, then it's all over the place. So you'll probably want to do that. So go ahead and start with that. So you're going to measure a half a cup of milk. Now, it's going to come out of the carton. So if your child's old enough to pour the milk out of the carton, they can do that. Or you can show them on, you know, a cup measure, a cup measuring cup where the half cup point is. Show them where that is. So they're working on measuring and math and things like that. And then you can pour the milk in and say, okay, tell me when to stop when I get to the one half, you know, line. Okay, so then they're helping with that. Okay, and you're also going to need vanilla. I'm just going to get set up ready to go. Okay, so you're going to pour that half cup in the bag. Now this makes enough for you and your child to have a small little snack together. Nothing, nothing too big. And then we're going to put um, one tablespoon of sugar in. So now your child can measure that. They can put the tablespoon in the sugar, bring it out, and then pour it in the bag that you're holding on to. So you can talk about that. What do you think the sugar is going to make it taste like? Is it going to make it taste sweet or salty? And of course, we know that it tastes sweet. And then you're going to do the half teaspoon of vanilla. And of course, if you get more vanilla in, you know, it's okay because it tastes really good. And then you need to seal it up really, really tight. Make sure you seal it up really tight. And, um, you know, I'm just going to get the air out of there. So make sure it's sealed up really good. Okay, so now we're going to put that aside because we're done with that part. And that's the part, of course, you can talk with your child. That's going to be the ice cream that you eat later. Okay, so now what you need is a big gallon sized bag because we're going to fill this up with ice and rock salt. And you can talk about how that's going to happen, the reaction between the ice and the rock salt, and that's going to make the ice cream. So let me show you. So just go ahead and fill up a half, like a half of this bag with, um, with ice. And it's written on here. So a half bag of ice, and then we're going to do six tablespoons of rock salt. <clears throat> now your child can help you put the ice in, of course. Get those hands wet and cold, but you know, that's fine. So let's see. Oh yeah, that's good. And then the rock salt. Now I just have it in a little bag here, but of course it comes in a box. So you can just leave it in a box and then have your child measure six tablespoons. So tell them they need six, six of these and put it in the bag with the ice. So one, and you can count together. Two. Three, four, five, six. Okay, so then that's all in there. Now what's going to happen is you're going to put your small sandwich bag with the whole milk and the sugar and the vanilla inside this bag. That's why you want it sealed up really, really tight because you don't want to get any of the... the um, salt or water or anything in there and um, just kind of put it place it in there and then you're going to seal this one up really tight now a good idea is to go outside and shake this up because of course the ice is going to start melting and you're going to get water and stuff all over the place so so and then what you just do is and now it's going to take about five minutes to make the ice cream so you can have your child shake it a little bit and then once their little arms get tired, you're probably going to have to do most of the shaking. But it's fun because they can kind of watch the process of it happen. And so you just keep shaking it. And then pretty soon, you can, you'll see it in the bag. It starts to get hard. And not as hard as ice cream, but hard enough. And it's really yummy, too. So shake, 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 shake. And then it will start to get harder and harder. 